Happy Sunday, folks. I'm going to share with you today, uh, probably a short video, um, some Silver Age books I picked up. I think they're all marble uh, today in varying degrees of condition, but all books that we're happy to have. So the first one is Tales of Suspense, number 93. Uh, you can see on the cover, <clears throat> Silver Surfer holding Hulk's hand. Um, two of my favorite characters. You know, I've talked before that, I think it's Fantastic Four number, is it 52 or 50? No, number 50, the Silver Surfer cover that I like, I have multiple copies of. I always like Hulk, uh, still trying to get Hulk 181, 180, <clears throat> Hulk number one, uh, a few other Hulks. I just, it's a good storyline, I, I like it. So anyway, um, you can see someone wrote their name on it. Uh, you can see across the top there's chipping. It's not at all in good condition. And if I show you the bottom here, it is definitely kind of falling apart, but it's still a Silver Age book. It's a 12 center. I bet you, I know someone, I think Alex is probably going to like this one. He loves Fantastic Four. This is Fantastic Four number 58. Uh, presents pretty well. You know, it's it's not perfect. There's some, I don't know if it'll pick up here, maybe a little bit of discoloration across the top. There's a little bit of a, a crease in the upper right corner. Let's see. A little... Is that the bag? I can't tell if that's the bag. The bag's pretty raggedy, so it's you know, a little bit of an indentation right there in the corner, and a little bit of a, looks like it was dropped. Small little bend there, but otherwise, you know, it's a pretty nice book. I would say it's probably um, a mid-grade, maybe a maybe a five, I don't know. Maybe I'm being too, too tough on it, but it's a good book, Fantastic 458, 12 center. <clears throat> I really like covers that have a lot of black on them. This book has that. The Mighty Avengers number 64, 12 center. Uh, just looks awesome. I mean, Vision. I assume that's Black Panther. Is that Cyclops? Would that be Cyclops? Um, I think that's Goliath. Uh, just pretty neat. <clears throat> yeah, there's, it looked like there's some damage here across the top. Uh, spine looks, besides at the very top here, looks to be pretty good. So these are some that I'll take out and read. And who knows, maybe I'll read one of these in a video. I don't know if there's any interest in, feel, in folks having me read some of the books and the videos. But I may do that. And if you don't want to watch it, I'm okay with that. Um... But I did not. I did not have a, any of the books that I'm showing. I don't think I have any of them until now. So these are my first copies. Uh, next up, Avengers six uh, number thirty six, a twelve center. Love Hawkeye on the cover. And Cap. Um, that's the Altroids attack. It's yeah. It's faded. You can see. Let me hold this the side here. I think it picks up here. There's. Some fade all across the cover, near the spine, all the way towards the top. Uh, other than that, not bad. Uh, it's a nice cover. It, it shows pretty well. There's a little bit of, um, you know, fading, I guess, over here. A little crease right here and some damage over here. But you know what? Just to have it in the collection, glad to have it, and I will be reading it. So... Here's one that I didn't think I was going to see. Uh, Daredevil number six. And this is on the bag itself, guys. It's an old price sticker. Uh, it's not on the comic book itself. Yeah, the book's not in great condition. Um, I'll point out it's missing a little bit of paper on the cover here. There's a, a tear pullover here. And the, I think the tear goes up to maybe to here. And then there's a big crease. And there's a tear right here at the C for here comes through the R of Daredevil. You know, spine ticks, um, missing a little bit of pieces along the bottom of the book, the front cover, but you know what? It's still Daredevil number six. It's early Daredevil. Um, you don't see these every day, so I'm glad to have it. 
And rounding out today's group, another Avengers. Whenever I see Avengers, I try to buy them. Um, Daredevil, you know, if it's interesting to me, I'll buy it. And Fantastic Four, as much as I can, I try to buy it. But here's Daredevil 41. <clears throat> this is actually an interesting book um, featuring Diablo and the ever-delightful Dragon Man. So um, I was not that familiar with this book, but it's actually a fairly popular book to pick up. So, And it actually shows pretty well. Um, you know, some obvious wear here in the upper left corner, some, some ticks across the top, but it's a black, a lot of black on the cover and it shows pretty well. <coughs> it does look like, I don't know if it rolled, because you can see there's a staple, let me lift this up. There's a staple right here where my thumb is, um, maybe like an eighth of an inch from the spine. Uh, it looks like it's just rolled. And then there's one over here. Uh, let's see if I can pick up that right here. So it's not perfectly flush, but it, it doesn't look like it's restapled. So maybe it's, I don't know, maybe it's um, rolled a little bit or maybe it's just a factory defect. But overall, really nice book. Um, glad to have it. Some of these books I'd be willing to trade the Avengers ones, yeah, probably not, but who knows. Um, anyway, guys, if you have these, if there's any really cool storylines about them, let me know. If there's anything particularly collectible about them, let me know too, if you would. Uh, as always, appreciate it. Have a great day and read on.